Capricorn, I've had to meditate over this energy for quite a while, you guys. Um, so that's why you've got your videos a little bit later than the rest of the videos. But um, I do feel like um, self-judgment is an issue. And I believe that this self-judgment is coming from a different individual. OK, I feel like this person has done the absolute positive ass most. OK, um, this person hey, has baby. I love you too bad. This person has tried to annihilate you, Capricorn, okay? And when I say annihilate you, I mean through their intentions. They wanted to destroy um, you. Um, they didn't want you to have self-esteem. Um, this person um, really tried to kill, kill, you know, the light that you have inside of you, okay? Um, and for, I don't really know the reason other than the fact that they're just you know, not a wands at this point. Um, you could have been dealing with a cancer, Pisces or Scorpio. That's definitely possible. Um, this person damn sure is coming up as manipulative. I do see where you love them. I do. I do see where there is a reason why you love them. Okay. Um, I do see where they were emotionally balanced for some of you as, at one particular time. Some of this person may be your wife. This person may be your husband or had the potential to be your wife or your husband at one particular time. Okay. Um, I see where I see this person's passion. Okay. Um, I see where this person is possibly a father or mother to your children. Um, loyal. I see where you felt like they were loyal. They have damn sure showed up at times where you've needed them the most. Okay. Um, for some of you guys, um, I feel like this person showed some type of diplomacy and cared. I feel like you felt like they were, they could be devoted. Okay. But really to be honest with you, this person is very nonchalant. This person is very friendly to other individuals more so than to you. Um, and this person is showing up is manipulative okay this person is showing up as having a lot of lust okay this person definitely finds you very 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 attractive um sexually um this person's fetishes may run deep here with this lust card i'm just gonna show it to you so you can get your picture yourself I'm just saying okay just saying all right um this person definitely is lurking all right they're lusting, they're lurking, okay? They are spying, they're watching, they're keeping tabs on you, okay? It's almost a possessive type of energy, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to be here with you, but at the same time, I want to possess, I want to be possessive over you anyway, even if I'm not here, okay? Because like I said, you know, um, this person definitely does... Um, create a situation for some of you guys to where they're not available okay you guys it's like they are available when they want to be available to you okay but there is um there there's someone that this person is someone who is not readily available to somebody all the time okay the accessibility factor of this individual okay is something going on there definitely showing up as a cheater okay um definitely showing up for uh wanting uh some type of handout looking for something for free um, and showing up as having some type of money issues, you guys. I feel like this person likes to sit on the porch or the backyard, or maybe um, there's a place where they like to sit and think. Okay, um, but uh, they definitely um, they're they're very much so up against the wall right now because they're definitely having money issues. Okay, and they're they're definitely going to be coming back around here to um, to talk to you because maybe they feel like they can get some type of money out of you and sex, as a matter of fact. But yes, this person is definitely spying, watching, and keeping tabs on you um on your social media talking to your friends and family reaching out you know they may be getting information and maybe somebody doesn't really know that they're fishing for information but that's what they're doing you know what i'm saying um let me go ahead i'm gonna glean a little bit for myself i feel like this person dang sure did try to come after you the light that you had um i feel like you guys for some of you guys i have this card i'm, I'm holding hands something about holding hands with this individual it did something to somebody here okay um this is love somebody loves this person a lot okay um this person is very toxic but tell me why this um self-judgment right they made you feel less than unworthy didn't deserve okay what is that december january february october November. Okay, I don't know why I'm saying that. Okay, you guys. But anyway, um, annihilate. They try to annihilate you. Okay, it's just that simple. They want to take you out. Okay, they want to take your money out. Um, they caused you some debt here. Contracts, career in or commitment broke you. Okay, straight up. If it didn't break, well, it didn't break you. It, if you felt like it broke you, okay, but it didn't really break you. Um, but that's what they wanted to do, you guys. Person did that shit on purpose. All right. Um, they knew that you were going to help them in any way. And even to the point, see, sabotage. They're very guilty, okay? Um, yes, you love them, okay? I feel like this person, you know, 
very injustice okay very unfair you guys this is very unbalanced all right somebody damn sure gave more than what they received they put more into this relationship the situation than they ever received back so for some of you guys you've been with this person through court and legal issues as well okay but right now you're feeling an injustice okay um lust is here all right and they're going to be dealt with behind this here lust because it has gotten out of control all right you know there's nothing wrong with you know you know grown people doing what grown people do but when you got this type of situation right here you know that got to get dealt with okay uh you can't just you know um for some of you guys uh, this person is sells themselves you know trick off whatever the case may be okay this person is damn sure fucked up they home they family home and or commitment because of these sexual addictions that they got going on we got bisexuality we got threesomes here you guys um you know this is um this is some crazy shit right here okay um but anyway they're lurking okay um spying watching keeping tabs right because they're at any move any in any moment they're ready to get active okay you guys they feel like you are a gift to them they feel like you're going to bail them out of whatever situation and all they need to do is come towards you that's it okay and right now they got money issues right they're going to be projecting okay you need to understand it's your fault okay everything that's ever happened is always your fault that's not going to change okay and, or whoever okay it's everybody else's faults up there okay um because they're you know they're adventurous they're in and out okay um take risks they're at a distance right now you guys uh they're distancing themselves from you all right or they're distancing themselves from somebody else but free-spirited told you they don't listen to shit they don't listen to reason they don't listen to anything okay anybody they're very intense they're inconsistent they move at swift speed they got a lot of distance right now they're they're in retreat time out their life is in retreat their life is time out right now because of the decisions that they've made so they're hit with limitations and right now you guys they're very fearful okay so they want a handout y'all is what i'm trying to say all right they're looking for something they're not going to be telling you the truth all right you guys are going to be coming up with some type of lies all right um showing up as a cheater holy spirit okay i don't know cancer pisces scorpio they're very emotional somebody was emotional about this here cheating somebody keeps thinking about it somebody i feel like this is you capricorn i feel like it's you that can't stop thinking about this here cheating that they've done because what it has effectively done is effectively caused somebody to doubt their own self you see what i'm saying i don't care how beautiful how much money all that shit you got it's almost like because of their actions it's made somebody feel like they weren't worthy like they didn't deserve you see what i'm saying like you know just real fucked up inside you know what i'm saying but that's a lie though you see what i'm saying that's a lie from the pit of hell that is not the truth okay it doesn't matter what you look like what you got what you don't have you are worthy all right i'm telling you you are okay don't let this person make you feel this way um even though i know that that's i, I know that that that's not a reality because you put so much stock in what they say you put so much stock in in their behavior and you're wondering you know well if i was this or if i was that then why would this happen to me well look at other everybody else who do you who do you feel is beautiful who do you feel is handsome who do you feel got the bag who do you feel didn't, didn't trust me it happens to them as well okay so who if you if you if you're judging yourself with this here such self-judgment and saying i obviously and apparently am not worthy of x y and z right well you know what logically speaking okay everybody goes through bullshit okay everybody it doesn't matter all right you guys so don't allow this person to fuck with your self-esteem okay period they need some money right now okay you guys we're just that simple okay they have they didn't they they done ran out okay they, they got debt your debt and then created some old debt from somewhere else yeah listen they're always in debt they always got money issues okay they need to stop drinking so much okay um they know that with you there's abundance but the thing about it is they're so damn guarded they refuse to be vulnerable they refuse to be vulnerable they're guarded okay and the reason why is because they like to cast a confusion and illusion they want what you got they want this wishes granted they want this nine of cups they want to have this abundance this here they're greedy okay you guys it really just is that simple they want this here prosperity with you but they want to be guarded and they want to um i told you they're gonna be lying okay Want the handout, they want to cast confusion and illusion and carry it on. Yeah, see? Disharmony triggering the flow. Get ready for it. 
excuse me, disharmony, triggers, and conflict. Be ready for it. They want you to give to them. They're spying and watching. You guys, they're spying you. They, I don't care how they act because I, I can feel this energy of I don't want you. I don't need you. You know, that type of old bullshit. But they're lying, you guys, because they're watching you. Because if they don't need you and want you, then why is the hell they stalking you? Why are they stalking you? For some of you, they're watching you with self-love. For some of you, they're watching you with this self-care. So with this here, they try to ruin, snuff out your light. Try to make it seem like you wasn't worthy or desire. What, you're, what they're watching you do is they're watching you become the person who they did not want you to become. Okay, You're starting to see some things in yourself that they didn't want you to see. Because as long as you see this, there's no way in the world that you want to deal with their ass. Okay, In the form of self-care. In the form of raising one's vibration. In the form of self-love. In the form of being a co-creator. Setting intentions. Paying attention to your intentions when it comes down to to your well-being, okay? Mentally, physically, spiritually, and emotionally, all right? Yeah, because they ass ain't on the menu. It's, it's all about when they want to. You're about to be getting the message, okay, you guys? Um, Mercury, that will be Gemini and Virgo, okay? So you're going to be getting a message from this individual, okay? I don't know. I don't know what this message is, y'all. You know, let me get the uh, tarot. But yeah, this person is a piece of work. I don't like the fact that they sit up here. And on purpose, they did this shit. You know, on purpose, they, they try to make somebody feel a certain type of way. Shit is not right. But they do have a sex addiction, you guys. Um, they do like to lie. There will be uh, messages that they will be trying to give to you. I do feel like this is very um, painful. This cheating situation, this third party situation um, is very painful that somebody cannot get over. Listen, they're tricking off, y'all. They're selling themselves and they're tricking off, okay? For some of you, that will be the truth, all right? They're projecting, they're blame sh shifting, they're lurking, they are sabotaging. They have already sabotaged debt upon debt, contracts, career, and commitment and or commitment this person is being slapped with limitations right now this person is uh definitely um disharmony triggered and in, in conflict and going to be bringing that energy to you too so be on the lookout because this person definitely wants to lie and they want to put somebody in some type of confusion and delusions here do not let that happen you've done a lot of work on yourself here with the self-care you've raised your inner your vibration okay you're you're glowing right now okay yes it was an injustice and guess what when we got this type of situation, Capricorn, that means that the universe is told what to do, okay? God is the creator. The universe is the tool. The, the mission is, it's karma, okay? It's what it is. The person may have legal issues as well, okay? Capricorn, much love, much respect, you guys. Thank you so much for still being here with me. I love you guys to death, you guys. Um, sorry that it's been so long for me to uh, put a video up, you guys, but your girl had to rest, and I still was doing reads. For the ones of you that know me, y'all know I'll be reading all night long, okay, you guys? Um, and even with my new tarot, reader, tarot readers that I have, I still have a lot of people who I read for, okay? Train to go, shout out, VIPs, thank you so much for your support. And also my day one, solid, much love, okay? Um, remember, for every 100 new subscribers, somebody will get a free read, okay? Be on the lookout. I will announce it. And congratulations to the ones that are getting free reads. Um, um, uh, that has um, really, you know, been a part of the channel, showing up for the channel, commenting and stuff like that, okay? Those are who I look for, you guys. So the more that I see you, the higher your chances are to win, okay? So let's go ahead and get into this uh, read. Let's pray first, okay? Um, so we're going to pray in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, uh, Capricorn. I ask for truth, revelation, confirmation, guidance, consolation, peace, and protection as I give Jesus Christ, Yeshua, Messiah, all the praise, the honor, and the glory. And here we go again with this love, okay? I don't know who is messing with this Cancer, this Scorpio, or this Pisces, all right? But whoever is messing with this, because it's twice now, okay, it's come out, all right? This is a whole different deck. All right, let's get to it. All right. They, they, didn't, they didn't try to snuff your light out. OK, this we know. All right. Didn't happen. Ain't going to happen, especially if you're a child of God. It ain't going to happen. Only thing that only thing that pain did for real. And you may not even be in that situation yet. But the only thing that that pain did. And listen very carefully for the ones that supply. The only thing that pain did was t turn in. It's going to turn into passion. It's going to turn into purpose. All right. L nothing happens for a reason. All right. You're still standing for a reason, even though this was meant to bring you to your knees. And for some of you, it did. OK, but like I said, you're still here being juggled, being lied to, being used, double life, 
Okay, being married, you may be married to this person, this person having third party situations. You may be the third party. They may have told you that they're going to leave their husband, they're going to leave their wife. Got you all messed up in the middle of some bullshit. Juggling and carrying on, mixed messages, changing, having to adapt to them. Being flexible for their ass. You knew better. There was something that told you something about this situation. What does High Priestess know? To get to your money. You still paid attention to your money. Stability. Harmies. You're going to have money coming, okay? Listen, you made a move here, okay, that opened up some energy, some opened up some portals to get you some money here, okay? This is a blessing, all right? You guys, this is stability. This is savings. This is investing. Um, and, and you did offer this to this person. You wanted to offer this to, to this person. We got a Leo Sagittarius Aries that just pulled up. Holy Spirit, what's going on? Puzzle pieces, y'all. Okay, here we go with the third party situation. Now, you could be dealing with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio who had you in a third party situation with a Gemini, a Leo Sagittarius, or you could be dealing with a Leo Sagittarius Aries or a Gemini and had you in third party with a Scorpio, Pisces, or a um, Cancer, okay? A Virgo Taurus Capricorn is here too, okay? Somebody baby mom, baby dad, somebody who somebody is, you know. Give me more. What is she doing? flirting so this person likes to flirt okay definitely rather it's a leo sagittarius aries cancer pisces scorpio gemini or virgo taurus capricorn doesn't matter this person likes to flirt this person cannot get enough okay of attention all right you guys love messages is here I expect some communication definitely puzzle pieces yeah and they're gonna be sitting up here trying to give you love all right remember the time remember when we did this remember when we did that yeah Expect that, okay? Oh, I want my dreams to come. Let's dream again. You know what I'm saying? That type of shit. Let's make it happen. Let's have foresight. Let's, let's have vision. Let's talk about what we want to do again. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so they can get you like this. Hemped up, okay? Anxiety, fear, helplessness, fear of uh, powerlessness victimized even lust holy spirit baby mom baby dad somebody pregnant somebody was pregnant possibly abortion possibly a miscarriage kids yeah but then it sat up here had third party situation with holy spirit because it is lust right all these lies these alibis that they ass came up with so they lurking okay Thinking and lurking. Virgo is here. Thinking and lurking. Analyzing. They're watching you ascend. Yeah, thinking and lurking on how the hell they can backstab you once a fucking again. Okay? Or they may be thinking and lurking and, and maybe feeling bad about backstabbing you, leaving you for dead. Painful ending. Yeah, Taurus Aries is here. Somebody's older here. Give me more. They're on their way back, y'all. They're driven to succeed, okay? They want victory. The reason why they want victory is because they need something, okay? Leo Sagittarius Aries is here. What are they doing? Besides finessing. Who? Going to be calling you. Going to be reaching out to you, okay? Eight of Wands. Might be talking about travel. Maybe Casey communication. Maybe may in need, okay? Maybe calling you from jail, okay? In a situation, all right? Yeah, see, this this Knight of um, Wands definitely does need for you to give to them. They need to give something. They need some sex. They need some money. They need some shelter, some vehicle. They need something, okay? They need a psychiatrist is what they need, okay? Because they're too adventurous, too in and out. They need to sit the hell down, okay? Somebody is not going to want to be dealing with this. Or they are going to pull their energy back. Be on the lookout for that, okay? Person showing up as a cheater, all right? You guys... Straight cheater, not a wants twice. Okay, you guys, this person is very in and out, very inconsistent. All right, they have literally stomped on somebody's heart here. They don't listen to shit and then they leave. So not only do they stomp on somebody's heart, they go, they ghost, no closure, leaving. Okay, dipping off to the next. They got somebody else. All right, they want to hand out jail, legal problems, perhaps. Maybe they're not feeling well. Wounded, set back, guarded. Definitely know they need. They definitely know they can get some money from you. They're looking at you. What's going on? But you know too much. 
See, that's the thing. You found out too much. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. What's going on? Yeah, see, you're into your recovery, okay? You're into leaving past alone. You're trying to heal, okay? You're, tr you're trying to forward moving meant this thing. You're trying to peace after the storm. Yeah, because it's been too many lies. It's been too much deceit, okay? That's why. It's been too some somebody stomping on somebody's heart and always leaving. That's why. Lying, stealing, killing, cheating, thieving, faking, phony. Somebody got stole from, lied to. This shit is a weight around somebody's fucking neck. All this deception. And why wouldn't it be? Yeah, they feel like it's wishes granted. Why wouldn't it be wishes granted for them when they getting what they want? Right. But guess what? Somebody fixed to be crying a river. You take them back, possibly you. If you don't take them back, possibly them. Okay? Because they want this nine of cups. 18, 9, damn sure do. They damn sure do is greedy, y'all. They damn sure do need some money, some stability. They're trying to attain some type of satisfaction, some type of comfort. Cause they crying a river right now. Shit is not where they want. They do not listen. They un very, they're very, very uncomfortable. Y'all heard about that? Um, what Diddy was talking about about how he don't want to eat the jail food. Y'all, okay, it's like that. All right, you guys. Bottom line is jail food is jail food. It's been like that for a long time. Anybody? It's a whole lot of people here that have been to jail. A whole lot of people know what it is. Okay, it's, it's that type of attitude. Okay, cause you so used to having shit your fucking way. Okay, and now you got to take a step down and you done fell from grace. Now you that uncomfortable? Yeah, right. Now did you don't want to eat? Okay, whatever. All right. So, but but bottom line is, is yeah, they they they. they, they they got money issues, okay? They want to be comfortable, all right? They want their confidence and their happiness back. Some of them niggas went and got somebody pregnant. Or you may be pregnant. Holy Spirit, give me more. Think they got all the sense, y'all. All the sense. Putting together a master plan to cut somebody ass off again once they get it. Legal issues is here. They're very unfair. They want some type of handout. They want some handout, even though they're not willing to stop this socialization. They're not willing to stop these third party situations. They're not willing to stop all this kicking it, all this coming come home when the hell they want to, three, four days and shit pass by, okay? Without hearing from this individual. Because they friends and they family and all this is more important than somebody here, okay? So this is the reason why your twin flame, your soulmate connection has made the decisions to put other people above you because they're out here too spontaneous and feels like they can do what they want to do, how they want to do it. These scales are not balanced and karma is going to be spinning that block. Temperance upside down, damn right. Somebody might have been married to this person. Damn sure I've been invested in this person. Damn sure love this person. Damn sure did. Okay. If you guys are still here with me, um, please go ahead and drop me um, a black heart. Black heart, you guys. Um, that's going to let me know two things. One, that you do want a free read and that you are still here with me. If you guys are in the shadows, if you guys been in the channel, you guys are new and recent, please come out of the shadows. Let me know that you guys are new and recent. You guys, one of my favorite things to do is to get to know you guys. I swear, I got uh, literally... A serious hands-on uh, relationship with a lot of my subscribers. That's real talk, y'all. I love you guys to death. And I would love to have that same relationship with you. I invite you to introduce yourself. I love giving warm welcomes, okay? Crosswatcher Energy, damn sure can get involved in this. Crosswatcher, I want you guys to know that I love Crosswatcher just like I love Capricorn. And if you guys, um, if this is, you know, vice versa and it's happened to you, go down there. Let me know that this is what has happened to you. And it was a Capricorn did this, okay? Um, I do look at each and every one of you guys' uh, statements and, and comments and posts um, and, and randomly, um, I will, you know, if I'm in my office um, and I'm by my laptop, I will pull some cards for your situation down there in the comments. That is for my subscribers. I love doing that. Um, and But it's random, you guys. You do have to be a subscriber to do that, um, to take part in that. Um, but, um, I don't need a book. Okay. You guys only need just a few little things, just, just a few sentences, you know, just a little bit of energy. Okay. I pick up on energy very, very, very well. Okay. So I don't need the whole story. You guys, I'll be able to, to, to pull. All right. Um, you guys, uh, drawing train to go. That is my sisterhood. We are clicked up train to go much love, much respect. You guys, it is, um, like I said, a sisterhood full of 
bunch of um, entrepreneurs, celebrities, people on spiritual journeys. We all have things that um, we're going through. We are all growing and ascending and trying to go. Trying to go. Listen, it's not about me being, you know, a TTG. I'm also a TTG member as well. OK, I lean on my sisters just like my sisters lean on me. OK, you guys. So I'm going to have my husband do a brotherhood. OK, you guys, because I'm married to a Taurus and. You know, you know how that goes. OK, um, but anyway, my uh, tarot readers, you guys will um, go down there. I got two of them. I got one is my main reader that reads for me, my assistant reader. And you guys, um, they will be the ones that will be getting back to you when you get the free reads. Look out on the community channel. You guys, congratulations to all the ones that's getting the free reads. It is my pleasure to be able to do that. OK. So with that being said, puzzle pieces, I'm about to give you guys um, some time frames and some letters here. OK, you guys. Um, and uh, and also let you guys know who's here. Also, with trying to go members. You guys, it's a lot more accessible to me. It's easier to get in contact with me. OK, you guys, if you guys are interested in a regal in the description box. You guys will find all that information out. OK, so we got January. We got March. We got Mother's Day. We got June. We got October. We got November and we got December. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say that again. January, March, Mother's Day, June, October, November, December. OK, so the letters, you guys. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Remember puzzle pieces. The letter J, the letter E, the letter V, the letter F, the letter R, the letter H, the letter U, the letter K. Two Ks. Um, two Ts. Two I's. Okay. Letter J. Letter E. V. F. R. H. U. Two Ks. Two Ts. Two I's. Underneath the deck, we got the letter G, okay? So, I'm going to tell you guys who's here. We're going to close out. Yes, they want to have you like this, okay? They like having you in bondage, all right? They, they don't want you to go anywhere. It's like they can do what they want to do, but you can't, all right, you guys? That's how that's how they, they may be going to jail. They might be in jail, too, by the way, okay? So, um, if I mention it uh, several times, this means that it's heavy. I got Gemini here. Scorpio is here. This is your twin flame, so I'll make connection, okay? For a lot of you, that will be true. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius is here. Leo is here. Somebody wants some peace. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. You will be hearing information. You will be hearing from this person. I got this several times. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. This person dips. All right. They get missing. But they are coming back. All right. You need to understand that. In chariot mode, by the way. Okay. That means that they know what they want. All right. Um, but what they're going to end up doing is betraying. Okay. Virgo is here. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Gemini, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. You got money coming, um, Capricorn. Be on the lookout, okay? And this might be the reason why they ask is coming around, if they know about your money, okay? Um, we got Gemini. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Right, injustice. It's always been injustice. These scales are not balanced. They may, you know what? If I was to make this a little bit longer, to be honest with you, you guys, uh, they asses might be receiving karma for all these illusions and delusions that they like to be casting over people, okay? This disharmony triggers and conflict that they cause people, okay? This distance that, you know, this push and pull distance, all this money they done went through, okay? And put somebody in serious ass debt. Somebody done bailed their ass out of jail and some more shit. Female, male, it don't matter. Females go to jail too. Um, but it doesn't matter. You know what I'm saying? They project like crazy. Messed up a whole family home and or commitment. Listen, this person's not in a good mood, you guys. They're very emotional. You need to be on a, uh, a spec, um, some communication, okay? Maybe hasty communication. Maybe trying to blame you for something. I don't know. It feels like it to me. Um, but anyway, Capricorn, hopefully I was able to put that one piece together and remember. Don't nobody determine your self-worth. Don't nobody determine you, the way you feel about yourself except you, okay? And if you ever, ever, ever need to find a, like a reminder, go to the Bible. Find out what God said about you, about how wonderfully and fearfully you made. Ain't nobody on this planet. There's 8 billion people on this planet, okay? Ain't nobody can't tell you that you're not worthy. Ain't nobody can't tell you that you don't deserve. Only way that can happen is if you get on board with the individuals who do that. And I would suggest that you start cutting off individuals like that because you got a future. You got the Ace of Pentacles that's in your energy. You got some money coming, stability coming, money opportunities, investing coming. You ain't got time for this doubt. You ain't got time for this self judgment just because somebody trying to fuck with your 
self-esteem and stomp out your light, you got other people that wants to see your light. You got other people that need you. Okay. That is a blessing. Ace of Pentacles is a blessing. Okay. That means that you will be a blessing in somebody's life and you will be getting paid for it. Okay. So with that being said, y'all, y'all be blessed. All right. And understand that I was able, my job is to put one piece together for you. If I did that, that means I've done my job. I love you guys dearly. And it is always a pleasure. Crosswatcher Capricorn. Much love.